students. So I've come to realize that students cannot create folders. So even though I have given you um, availability to post anything and do whatever you can in Avalon as a student, Avalon Art Class as a student, uh, you can't post folders. And I just discovered this, so I'm sorry if you've gone through it and you've been a little bit frustrated about trying to upload your images to the folders. You won't be able to do that, so we've worked something else out. So instead, now I'm going to be sending you assignments. So each project, main project, will be uh, an assignment. So you'll get the assignment. The assignment will go out. And as you can see, this one, the Getty Museum Challenge Art Project number one has just gone out. So what you do is you open that assignment. And in the assignment, you're going to see all the information that you need on your right hand side. Go through that. Um, and then over here is where you upload your work. Now you can send me a Word document if you like, or anything else here. As you can see, you can submit those things. But most likely you're going to be uploading a file from your computer or a link from YouTube or something like that if you created something um, like a video or whatever. Um, so if you're going to be uploading a, a file or an image, you're going to go to File from Computer, click on that, and then this window will pop down or pop up. Uh, and you will click on the image that you're looking for, whether it's in your desktop or in your downloads or wherever it might be. And you're going to click on that image. I'm just going to click on this one, let's say, or actually let's click on the picture of my cat. Here we go. And see, it's uploaded and there it is. So it's going to be in there. And then um, once you've done that, if you want to upload a few more, you can. You can go back into Attach, click on File. Uh, let's take this little guy here. Say you're working on something like that, and there you've got a couple of them. And then you can say, I've turned in my assignment. So you click Turn in the assignment. And are you ready to turn in? Yes, so you turn it in. Okay, so let's go back to uh, the main page. So we can go over a few other things. All right, so all the posts are down here. As you can see, so let's just scroll through. There might be some videos for you. Thank you so much, guys, for doing the quiz. I know there was two that got posted by accident. Um, and also, if we go into the folders, you will see all the information you need. So if you're an upper, you go into the upper art folder. If you're a senior, you go into the uh, senior art folder. If you're a lower, you go into the lower's art folder. You'll see the art project, and each one of those grades will have the same stuff in it, but pertaining to your age group. So if you go into the art project number one, or just to let you know, there'll be another one next week, art project number two, number three and so on. So we're gonna we're gonna go into our project number one and in there you're gonna see all the information that you need for this project. So you want to start with the art project video number one, watch that, and then this is the additional information that you might need for that project. So let's pop out of there, go back to the main posts, and I also wanted to go into our daily art. So you're, um, you'll have it listed under your small groups. So click on daily art. And this is where we have our daily art activities. As well, we'll be focusing on different artists every week, that kind of thing. So here you're going to see some videos. And how do you post your artwork from here? Well, you can go into, uh, let's say for instance here, you did the scribble drawing, you can go down here to write a comment and you can post an image if you want. You can write a little bit like something, had, a, had fun with this activity um, and then post your image by clicking on here. It says attach files and image. And I'm going to click on, let's do this guy again. 
Um, so I found my image and I go to open and then I hit comment. And there he is, he's down there. If I want to delete it, I click on these three little um, dots on the side, I can edit it or I can delete it. Um, or you could um, just post it in here as well. So you can write something in here. Look at my squiggle drawing. I really liked it. Um, whatever. Uh, and then you can attach your files. Of course, I don't have a squiggle drawing, so I'm just going to throw my uh, that picture of that little gnome guy again in there. And you've got it in there and then you hit post and now you've posted it for everybody to see. So you can also go back and edit or delete it. And if you guys go into the folders You'll see again, Seniors Daily Art Folder, Uppers Daily Art Folder, Lowers Daily Art Folder. And in those are um, folders that have the weeks and the art activities that we did and any videos. So if you want to go back to, let's, let's say, the first two weeks, what were the videos there? You click on the in there and you have the videos that were posted that week. That way it makes it easier than scrolling through everything. Okay, so I think that's it. I know there's uh, was a few changes here and there about posting and folders, but I'm hoping this can help you guys out, and hopefully we won't have any more changes for this class. Thanks so much, guys, and I hope you're having a great day.